This custom ROM is just so amazing and why so? In this video, we are going to explore some amazing things which are included in this custom ROM and why this is just one of the most improved custom rooms right now. A lot of ROMs are already available there and this is one of them. We have Dubfest OS. It's based on Android 14 and I'm using the official stable version on my device which is Poco F5 and it's available for some other devices already. As you can see, having the security patch of latest April 2024, it's updated to the latest QPR2 update of course and as expected some of the features are missing but still a lot of things are changed here for example if you take a look at the launcher here as far as I know like in my previous videos where I have shown you Dubfest launcher is already there in this Dubfest custom room which is based on launcher 3 but it's not similar to the previous other custom rooms for example CR Droid, Project Matrix etc but with this new update things are now changed here if you take a look at the uh, launcher UI, it's a bit changed here. Also, if you take a look at the recent panel or recent UI, you can see if you disable the compact design, the UI was like that. If you enable this option, which is use compact action design, you will see we have just icons at the below. So we do not have any text like screenshot and clear. All these two options are available here for you. Everything else is just kind of same here. We have app drawer customizations options available. You can choose or enable themed icons even in the app drawer. Home screen have similar kind of options available like where you can enable or disable the at a glance widget in case you want to. Everything else is just similar here. You can see here icon bag options are there. So Dubfest or basically Dub Launcher is now changed here. It's updated to the latest version or you can say things are a bit changed here. Another thing or basically one of my favorite thing which is available here is the parallel space. Unlike some other Android 14 based custom rooms where we have a cloned apps feature available but with the Dubfest OS we have parallel space which is a very useful thing and it's quite better as compared to cloned apps because it lets you create multiple spaces so it just not clone one app or basically only one instance of that particular app we have options for around I guess four or five instances of any particular app also this parallel space is now updated you can see these two new options because previously whenever I use parallel space things were not there like that you have the option to choose the permission, allow install unknown source apps and allow setup device wallpaper. So these two options might be quite useful. You can see you can create multiple instances of any application in separate parallel space. So this is one of my favorite features and because it's only available in Dubfest OS while making this video, I'm just hoping other custom rooms should adapt because this is absolutely useful as compared to the cloned apps feature which is already there which is good but parallel space is actually better as compared to cloned apps if you take a look at some of the features for example in clock settings you will see the background chip option is missing from here but everything else so far i found most of the features are available there most of the features are working fine here i did not found any major bugs so far you can see island notification is also present here it's just similar to the other ones we have similar kind of things available in the quick settings panel too and if you take a look at the quick settings panel let me show the quick settings panel ui first you can see it's already there with the android 11 style quick settings panel which looks good you can customize it you can change the rows and columns and layout etc but we also have the quick settings header images available there you can see custom header images you can choose the installed headers a lot of options are already available this awesome series which i have applied so far is the header 27 this actually looks damn cool you can also choose the 25 24 3 4 etc etc uh, things are looking so interesting if you're looking forward to customization especially with the quick settings panel some amazing UI things are available there which you can customize and choose if you want to use the header images you can a collection of header images this is insane a lot of options are available here for you to customize of course if you need customization you always look out for the header image customizations or anything else similar to that things are already available here for you having a look at some of the other things here for example including the quick settings panel customizations we have lock screen and system options and yes, here are all the customization things like the icon pack or etc, etc, fonts, customization. 
if i move on to the security and privacy options you will see face unlock fingerprint unlock that's present here you also have the app locker available i guess yes it's present here you can choose you can use it in case you want to so these were the things i just wanted to let you know if you want to try it out link is already available in the description if you like this video don't forget to drop a like and also if you are new here don't forget to subscribe the channel we'll see you in the next one